Hello and welcome to Klepp's Garage. I'm Bruce and this is the fire truck section of Klepp's Garage. We're located somewhere in beautiful mid-Ohio. Maybe Midwest Ohio. Maybe just the Midwest. Anyhow, here we are. The following video is going to be a video of rescuing this 1957 Mac B model B85 fire truck. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Sorry, stole that from Tim Allen. Anyhow, uh, so the following video, we're going to show you about how we got it, how we got it running, and uh, what we do with it, and uh, just make it a YouTube video. This is an 85 foot aerial ladder built by the Maxim Corporation. This particular truck was built in Sydney, Ohio, and uh, the truck, truck chassis itself was built in Allentown, Pennsylvania, with the, the fire apparatus being built in Sydney. From there, it was trucked out to uh, Pomona, California, where it was in service to 1990. It was sold to a private owner until 2016, is when I bought it online at an auction. So anyhow, the eight-story ladder has four sections. It goes up uh, 85 feet. It's all hydraulic, uh, cable hydraulic, cable over hydraulic for the, the extension. Uh, it's quite steady. I don't know that I want to climb through the top without a harness, but I think you could still use this if you wanted to. And uh, so the whole rig is 40 foot long. And kind of looking here, I'm walking to the back truck. So here's the back of the truck and uh, the ladder extends out about another six feet. So uh, when the ladder is completely down, uh, it still sticks out the back. The whole truck though is still 40 foot long. Uh, and it also fit in a, a 10 foot garage door, actually about nine foot. So it uh, takes up about the room of two Cadillacs. And who don't have two Cadillacs sitting around? Anyhow, uh, we'll tell you some more about it. But that's it for the ladder section. truck was really ingenious uh, they even come up with a built-in staircase so you can get up and down off the ladder we'll just go down right now oh hey Don who parked Cadillac here well like I said everybody's got two Cadillacs sitting around we'll use this for a future YouTube event but right now we're still looking at the Mac maybe just pan over here you can see some of the controls these controls uh, Work the downriggers and uh, the ladder lock, and they have a lock valve, so when the downriggers are down, they're locked. 
This is the main control panel for the ladder. So one of the firemen would stand up here and work the ladder in a working fire. This panel down here was just used just to, once I got there and, and then that was done. So here's the cockpit of the Mac. We'll get in and show you what's going on up here. This is the business end of the truck. So of course you got your Maxidine 707 gas engine. What is that, like 11 liter, something like that. It's ridiculous. Anyhow, it's got a coupled up to a five speed transmission. Fifth gears direct. They didn't have a lot of gears, didn't have a lot of speeds because these are really built for town use. You're not running them back and forth on the interstate or the freeway. We got the PTO for the, for the, the ladder. And then, uh, of course, what every fire truck should have, air brakes. Just so nice. Oh, and if you want, you can just work just the, just the rear brakes in case you want to drift around the corner. <laughs> Anyhow, so we have our, our emergency lights and uh, foot controls for sirens. <laughs> fire truck stuff so pretty much all it full complement of gauges got your air gauges for there's twin tanks everything's double redundancy there's two sets of batteries you got batteries a batteries b you got air tank left air tank right everything's separate this is a separate system from the regular brakes in case you lose your air um, the only bad thing about this is armstrong steering no no power steering so no one finger driving this thing. This this is a real man's truck. Uh, I, don't, I doubt most guys would want to drive this today. And uh, you know a glove box to put your your fire gloves in. I guess I don't know what else you'd use that for, but uh, there it is. So this particular truck's only got thirty eight thousand miles on it, and the engine motor hours is sixty seven thousand hours. All original. Uh, truck starts and runs well, and you'll see a little short video of that here in a minute. lights on and just sitting here these, these fire trucks are really hot right now you might say they're on fire anyhow uh, you can pick these up for like scrap value or just a little bit more than scrap value and they're you know they're worth their weight in scrap <coughs> or more but anyhow uh this this truck here has got great history it's from pomona california it once graced the presence of the pomona fire company i believe it was uh fire station 182 is where it come from and we've done some research and provenance on the truck Truck is all original condition. We've just cleaned the heck out of it, shined it, and uh, got it operational. And uh, we're available for parades, lodge functions, weddings, and funerals. Hey, so we're back again, second day of filming. Decided to get Big Mac out, go for a little bit of a drive demonstrate the gears, noises, sounds, etc., etc. So uh, go through the starting procedure. Uh, of course, always make sure it's in neutral. That looks good. Shove your clutch in. I'm gonna turn on, uh, it has two ignitions, a left and a right. There's, it's a six cylinder. There's uh, six spark plugs on the left, six on the right. Run off two different distributors. And so we'll get a little, get a little gas and away she goes. Has a friction emergency brake on the drive shaft. No air brakes on the, on the emergency brakes. And uh, we'll see what you do.
station, not our fire station, but there's a fire station. Maybe I should just back in and get ready to go on a fire. Well, we can go look for a fire. Either way, there's a fire station. It's just awesome. So that concludes our first video of the YouTube video. So my suggestion to you is drive whatever you got, antique car, get them out, drive them. That's what we do. Ha <laughs> ha.